Okay, let's take this uh, 2003 on an 03 plate uh, Land Rover Defender 90 TD5 XS station wagon, six seater for a spin. This one's uh, in black with uh, black half leather. 86,000 miles, which we warrant is correct. We have actually sold this vehicle before, um, about 15 months ago, um, to its last owner. Just recently had a new cylinder head fitted to it. Um, all up together and lovely. So I've just done a few miles on it uh, last night and today. Drives absolutely perfectly, but we'll, uh, we'll show you what it's like. Starting it up, all the warning lights come on and go out the way they should. Apart from the ABS light, which doesn't go out until you're doing five miles an hour, which is absolutely correct for one of these. So, starts on the button, and there's no signs of any misfiring, hesitancy or overheating. I've just done about uh, eight or nine miles on it just now. Temperature gauge is sitting about one third up the uh, up the scale. Um, let's take it out. And break off. Let's turn this round a bit so rather than see me. You can see a bit of the dash on the road. You do on this one, being a TD5, when it's stone cold, you do get a little bit of uh, rumbling from the, uh, the clutch pilot bush. Uh, that is perfectly normal on a TD5, uh, just down to the design of them when they're, um, when they're stone cold. That soon disappears as soon as you warm up. Um, but no signs of uh, any misfiring, hesitancy or overheating from the motor. Another Defender going the other way, so famous Defender wave. Um, clutch and gearbox are nice letting my foot off the throttle sharply. There's minimal backlash in the transmission. And this one's actually really quite rattle free, unusually so for a station wagon because the, uh, the side windows often rattle, as does the tailgate with the uh, big heavy wheel on the back of it. But um, this one, going over these bumps, is really nice and uh, rattle free from that respect. It's really just a nice unmolested original XS. Um, it's got a decent stereo in it, uh, a Sony radio CD with, uh, uh, they've got extra plugs on it, can't see from here at the minute. It's certainly got Bluetooth on it. Steers nicely, not having to sort of fight it to go in a straight line. It's going, uh, going where it's placed and suspension wise there's no horrible bangs or clunks or anything. Feelings of harshness, it's all uh, it all feels thoroughly up together from, uh, from that respect. As I say, 86,000 miles, which is warranted. It's been a dark and miserable day here today, so hopefully you can see the video well enough. It's not too, uh, not too dark on there. specifically for uh, testing these because it's got lots of funny bumps and adverse cambers and things and it's very very good for sort of checking suspension and things like that on a, on a Defender. But this one's performing exactly the way it should. Up to 50 miles an hour now, there's no nasty smoke coming out the back of it or anything. Just uh, powering along quite happily. has got the, uh, the winter pack on it, so it's got, it's got a heated front screen, heated seats, uh, air conditioning, and obviously the half leather. If you do hear any sort of clunking on the video, it's not the vehicle itself, sometimes the, um, the camera mount does uh, vibrate a little bit. It's, it's mounted on the uh, passenger window and uh, obviously they can vibrate slightly but it's not the vehicle itself. But as I say, it just does what it's supposed to do. Just a nice straightforward 
abandoned it doesn't appear to have led too hard on life doesn't appear to have been sort of heavily used off road or anything even though that's what they're for front under braking no funny noises under braking at all turn in here there we have it really so my name's Simon you can reach me in the office on 0118 907 1495 or you can go to our website which is www.motodrome.co.uk for any further information Amen.